Factions of the Resistance are already uniting in answer to the voice's call. Soon bards will sing the, the day. Soon bards will sing of this day. They who conquered the conqueror. A tune I'm most anxious to hear. But a man like Walmart will not roll over dead at the first sign of trouble. I... My lady, as you say, he will muster his forces down to be put down to put down the rebellion I can't read! Then his gaze will turn to us against his full night. We would not last long. Listen. Where are his armies garrisoned? The Valmy's Imperial Army is comprised of three main divisions. One controls the north, one the south, and the third, the lands between. Emperor Walmart commands the northern forces. Their might easily exceeds our own. The south is led by my brother, Yen Fei. His toast is said to rival Walmart's. Divisions, are they? Hmm. I see a plan brewing in those eyes of yours, Robin. Um, if we could divide their divisions, disrupt communications, supplies, etc., then introduce misinformation to add to the confusion, a whisper here and there, the panic would spread on its own, and all the quicker for their great number. Such a giant force would collapse under its own weight. Seiri, the third division, stationed between the other two. Right. I said, at Fort Sager, halfway along the high road. In fact, not so far from there, from where we stand now. We might stand a chance against them, but it would take speed and luck. I wager Walmart and Yen Fei will hear our own exploits soon, if they haven't already. I suggest sending the bulk of our army to the north and the south mask our plan. An elite force led by Sir Krom might then quietly sleep along to Fort Steger. What say you? I say re! Get it? <laughs> right. Fee, we could all be dead before nightfall, yet not one of you so much as hesitates. Your courage is an inspiration. I... We will win this war yet by gods. Good morning, everybody. It's Men and Beyond, welcoming you back to the world of Fire Emblem Awakening. In the last episode, we met the voice, Tiki, who has been sleeping for centuries and has just been woken up in a completely different world, separated from all of her friends. But hopefully she'll make some new ones in this new generation. In this episode, time for Crom and Frederick to tie the knot. Uh, not quite. Not quite. My lord. My lord. Ah, good old my lord to start things off. And that concludes today's report, my lord. Good. All right. Thank you, Frederick. <sighs> hmm? Now there's something I never expected to hear. Is everything all right, Frederick? Forgive me. Oh, my apologies, sire. I did not mean for you to hear that. You all right? It's fine, but I want to know if you're alright. You're not coming down with something, are you? No. Not at all, my lord. I'm the picture of health. Really? Then why have you seemed so exhausted lately? You looked pale as a sheet this morning. I thought a risen had entered our camp. The other shepherds are worried as well. Is something the matter? My lord, I apologize again. I'm just... You see... I feel I've been of no use to either you or Lissa of late. What was that? You're mumbling. No. N nothing, my lord. It's nothing. Perhaps I simply need a bit of sleep. <laughs> then go rest. If there's anything bothering you, come tell me straight away. Oh, but before you go, thank you for patching up the holes in everyone's tents. I know mine is a lot more comfortable without the blasted draft. <clears throat> but my lord, I... How did you know? <sighs> Who else would fix a tiny detail like that after a long day of battle? So again, my friend, thank you, from everyone. There are days I think this entire army would fall apart if not for you. My thanks. My lord, I... I don't know what to say. Your praise is the highest honor. <laughs> it's just the truth, Frederick, that's all. 
Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to go speak with Robin. Of course. Robin's tent is that way, wasn't it? I'll get started straight away, my lord. What? Get started? Uh, are you clearing the gravel? Frederick, what in the world are you doing? Well... It wouldn't do to have you trip up and hurt yourself, sire. Surely, you see. Oh, are you worried you could trip over me, then? Of course. Not to worry, sire. I have a plan that will let me clear the path well ahead for you. Hmm. Um, Frederick? Yes? Is something amiss, my lord? Ah, oh, of course. The reeds are a hazard as well. I'll just pluck them here. No. That's not what I was going to say. None shall harm you. So careless of me, sire. I'll have the devils uprooted in just a moment. <laughs> oh, for the love of... All clear, sire. You could trod through camp without a worry or delay. God. Is this his idea of keeping things to a minimum? Still, I suppose if he keeps him happy... My lord. Did you say something? Uh, Frederick? Huh? For the love of the gods, I have a meeting with Robin! Pardon me. Oh yes, here she is now. Hello, Robin. Do pardon the intrusion. Wait. Frederick! We don't need you to! Well, you can dust later! And actually, you don't need to dust Robin at all, Frederick! Frederick! He's dusting Robin! I just imagine her sitting in the stinking tent and like, just pouting and he's just like dusting her. He's like, la 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 la! Like in his stinking maid outfit or something like that. Oh my god. Frederick is one of the best stinking characters. I don't give him enough credit, even though he has like the best line, pick a god and pray. Like, my god, he's amazing. You don't deserve to be in this screen, stinking creepy hand man. Um, oh my god, I still can love Frederick. Uh, who is... Oh, that's it! Wow, short communication session, okay. I guess I won't waste any time. We're going to start chapter 17. No delays, let's go. I forgot to get to the killing edge for... Oh, I forgot to get one for... Uh. Oh my. Look at those walls. This isn't going to be easy. It's not the walls I'm worried about. It's the hordes of Valmese inside them. No. Our best bet is a swift surgical strike right at their heart. If we could strike down their commander, the fortress will be ours. So, Con Flavia, your men will take on the forces surrounding the castle. That should create an opening for the smaller team led by Krom and I. I regret... <clears throat> Pardon me. I regret to say this will put you at the forefront of the battle, Sir Krom. I wouldn't have it any other way. <sighs> then it's settled. Other resistance forces are on the way. With luck, they'll arrive in time to help. Let's clear a proud trail of Imperial blood for us to, to find us by. Okay. That's one way of putting it. Oh, we're separated. We're split up quite a bit, actually. Uh, I could have my whole team with me. That's cool. Uh, Fooey, Olivia. Does anyone else have a killing edge that you could take? Uh, she. I could give you Ceres for the time being. She does well with a steel sword, honestly. I don't need to make her crazy overpowered. Just for this battle only, I'll trade it. I'll do that, okay. And I guess we're good for now. Uh, with these guys, however. Uh, I could make Robin work as a swordsman if I really tried at it, but I just never try for it. Um, Lissa might be in danger zone this episode. I might want to give her a second axe. Uh, okay, Anna, we gotta work towards getting you leveled up in this uh, chapter. That's my number one priority. Guess that's it, but just a matter of who I want to pair up with whom. Uh, no one else got a partner upgrade, which was weird. Uh, even like Isari and Robin were the MVPs, weren't they? And like they didn't get any communication upgrade. I guess I'll put Frederick with Robin because I was working towards that as well. So Robin's maxed out with Lissa as well. Was he? I think so. No, wait, no, they're not. So I want to keep them connected for now. Olivia. Does Olivia have any communications with anyone on my team? Uh, anyone besides guys? Blanku, maybe? 
she could speak with pain. Uh, I want to get Lanku and Pain maxed out first. Let's put Pain right here and Lanku wherever he is. Okay. Anna with Cherish? Sure. Oh, yeah, we were doing Cherish and Noe before, so. Uh, wherever Noe is. Olivia with Seiri, maybe. Why not? Lucina, Tharja, Sumia. I guess this works for now. <laughs> such arrogance. They truly mean to assault Steger in such meager numbers. Perhaps they expect a woman's garrison to be a softer target. Heh. When I'm through, they'll wish they'd challenged Yenfei instead. Battle stations! Defeat the commander. Kinda scary that we're all spread out, but hopefully it'll turn out alright. Let's go and pair these two up. Uh, do I want them in the forefront? Would have actually been nice if I kept Lissa uh, with wherever I was bringing Anna because I want to keep her healed. Also, why did I pair them up? I don't know what. I'm stupid. Uh, how about Noe do that on your own, just so we can weaken that guy a bit, and then have Anna come in for the kill. If we can, that'd be rather nice. Uh, yes, it does work, okay. Though we want to get Frederick in there ASAP, so she's not the only target. No damage, though, that's very nice. And she's up to level six. A lot of singing stats for her. If only my profits grew this fast. Up next is you. Uh, hmm. Oh yeah, I forgot about Frederick and his lands is running out soon. I guess we'll do that for Robin. Very good. I feel like once we get past the initial first turn, then everything will calm down a bit because a lot of enemies will disappear, uh, both in our first attack and in their counterattack. Though, in my, as far as I'm concerned, like every attack is a counterattack, so I don't know. Oh, hopefully they can't reach. Well, Anna's in front, so it wouldn't matter, but duly noted with that bow user. They could shoot through walls, I'm pretty sure, if it's just a one tile wall, they would be able to shoot through here, so keep that in mind. Uh, long coup, go with pain. Lissa with Krom. Uh, convoy? Oh, Krom could go to the convoy whenever he wants because he's the leader. Or is that like a skill? No, he just do that because he's the leader. That's how that works. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll bring them over here. Olivia, let's... Who am I pairing up with whom? Uh, how about... Oh, uh, I wish I checked on these. I think these two communicate with each other, if I remember correctly. So, we'll pair them up together. Them! Up together. Sumia with... Seiri? Uh... Seiri's fine on her own, actually. So, I'll pair up with Lucina. So, it's... I guess that's what kind of messed us up. So, Noe and Seiri are on their own. Uh, let's see. Olivia, not quite. Not quite. And not quite. Oh boy. Uh, it's gonna be a while till we get her to be A OK in battle. Hopefully, I didn't make too big of a mistake with switching her to uh, just this other sword unit. Got a concoction. That's nice. I could switch it up if I want to still, I think. No, I'd have to wait till level 10, though. Or I think with Second Seal, you could do it whenever. Oh, with Master Seal, you have to wait till level 10. I think that's how it works. I'm not sure. Now I'll have to think about it. Now I'll just try and get good with what I got. It's basically what I did with my first playthrough, even though I, I didn't change any class. I just tried to get good with the base ones, and I got to the final boss without upgrading a single character. It was pretty cool. Uh... Poo. I'm just going to keep you here for now. 
And counterattack, what do we got? What do you got? Show me what you got, what you really, really got. You got a bunch of dodging. Oh, I thought it was Frederick. I was excited for Pick a God and Pray. Okay. Sari is going to counterattack all on her own, but Lucy is still there, so it'll help out a little bit. There you go. Steel Sword critical. I want to make sure she won't accidentally switch to the Bronze Sword when that breaks, though. That would be good to make track of. Might have been nice if I actually got rid of that from my inventory, but oh well. It would take effort, so I guess not. Vantage! Hello! We get to attack before they even attack. Even though it's their turn. My god, Sayri, you are stinking insane. Two level ups right there. She is the best stinking character. She's insane. Up next, we got those two. I wonder if they could hold their own. I stinking love this team. Everything about them is really stinking great. You really get attached to all your units when you just keep on going uh, through the game and get attached to all their power and see how great they get over time. It's really stinking cool. Unless you're playing on hard difficulties, in which case, it's probably not this simple and clean. Also, oh, was, I was like, was that fire? But no, it was thunder. The enemy was using fire, though. Got mend. I should give that to Alyssa. She's not on the side, is she? No, she isn't. Guess I'll get rid of this. Oh wait, no, listen, I gave her like a million healing things, so don't have to worry about that. Player phase. Oh, what do I wanna do? I will Hmm. Guess just get rid of this guy if we can. Oh, we got a column in the way. How unfortunate. I'll make this quick. 69, buddy! Oh, it's always great. Level up! Gotta wait for the audio to correct itself because you just get way too excited with these 69s. Uh, let's go over here. Uh, kind of, actually, no, not risky because Robin can have an attack as well. Uh, Fooey. For Anna, though, I should stay back a bit. Noe. Noe can counterattack. Uh, go over here. Uh, Sayuri, do I want her to have it? Eh, Lucina, why not? Don't really have anything else to do, like, it's more so my only priority with, uh, who gets experience now is just Anna. Olivia would be nice, just because, um, I'm still not completely satisfied with her power right now, so I guess I'll just keep that in mind. She's using an, uh, silver sword. I wonder if Killing Edge would change things, so we should do that next turn. Also, is that a... That's a door. Oh, that's awkward. Anna, where are you at, buddy? We should have you unlock this for us, because you're a thief. Or trickster, I guess, but whatever. I'll keep that in mind, because otherwise, Krom is a sitting duck. Gonna get rid of them. Uh, Chromatain level A with this sword, but it doesn't really matter because he always uses the same weapon. Now, question can Noe counterattack this? Because even though it's through a wall. Uh, yes, she can. No problem. Oh, uh, very close to a level up, but well. Tharja, gee, I wonder what's going to happen here. Get really, really sad when she runs out of the Katarina Bolt. So stinking powerful. That gets criticals every stinking turn. And she got Vengeance. Very cool. Uh, what does that do, I wonder? Add half a cure damage to attacks. Trigger percent equals skill stat. I don't know what that means, but whatever. I'm just going to assume it's awesome. Uh, phooey. Let's get... I think it would be more satisfactory just to have them go around as opposed to, like, Having Anna just unlock this pathway. Not super beneficial. Anna could unlock this stuff, which leads to a bunch of treasure. Good to know. 
There's a lot of treasure in this floor, so Anna, your time to shine, as long as you don't die. Uh, I better not regret this. Um, I'm gonna keep Noe here to just try and get rid of this guy. Would've been nice if oh, I should've done this before with when Anna was there, because she would've gotten the staff boost at the very least. Oh, but she gets a level up though, that's nice. Uh, level 20 now, just like with uh, Pain, the dragon, or the Manichetti has a higher max level than level, just level 20. So we can keep her in that for a bit longer. Robin, I want to give the experience to Anna though, so I'll just put him here, I guess. If they want to attack Robin, then fine, but if not, then we're good. Let's go this way. Uh, we'll bring them up here, up here, and up here. Who's left? These guys. Okay, do your worst. 35%, uh, come on, thank you. I would have been really angry with that hit. Oh boy. Thank you. 0%. Sold. Why do you even bother attacking down? No. 60 damage. Getting them level ups. Squirting that bubble juice. If you get that reference, you're awesome. If you don't get it, then that probably just sounds really creepy. Why are they all 0% for Anna? Not complaining, but still. Advantage, because Sayuri's the best. Oh, not quite. And no, he's going to finish off this uh, archer, so that's really nice. Kind of kind of wish we did have an archer on my team, but I don't know who I would want to switch that to. Then again, Noe is sort of like a weird archer, and uh, mages are archers, what do you think about it? Just because they could hit from afar. Okay. Switch to Olivia. Have her take this guy out, because I want her to get the experience. Oh, I forgot to switch her to the Killing Edge, but she did it anyway! Okay. Didn't even need to switch to the Killing Edge. Uh, I wish I could do that in her turn, but no. It's ended, so I can't do anything. Uh, I guess we'll go over here. Sayuri. I don't want her that close with that little HP, so... Head up here with Krom. Noe, you can finally move forward a bit, but first let's get this crowd out of the way. Uh, phooey. Hit rate, zero. well they have a 0% chance of hitting us, so I guess that's better. Kind of wish we had a dancer still because it would like to get a second turn, but no. Uh, I'm going to wait it out a bit because I want Anna to get that sweet, sweet experience. Okay. Okay. So, hey. How you guys doing? This is a fun game with Fire Emblem. Kind of run out of stuff to talk about when, like, every episode's an hour long. And, like, I'm just super happy and content with my sub. Just, like, a nice little strategy time. Talk about life and whatnot. Uh, did I mention that I got Katamari Damacy reroll lately? Like, I finally found it because, like, it seemed like it was, <coughs> it seemed like it was a limited run. So I was kind of worried that, like, I wouldn't be able to find it anywhere. But thankfully, it did get back in stock, so I was able to get a hold of it. And, my god, I got a lot more addicted to that game than I thought I would. And that was probably too early to end the turn. I probably could have got people through. Uh, oh, they're gonna try and steal. Sir Krom, I hear movement from the floor below. It may be reinforcements. Be wary. Good to know. Okay, let's see if we get rid of this guy. Come on. Thank you, critical. Gotta hurry up and get to that uh, treasure vault before the before the thief does. Oh yeah, he's just a regular thief. He's not even working for these guys. Let's go over here. Yeah, I really should have moved these guys beforehand. Oh well, we'll make it a lot more intense, I guess. So much for not having much to talk about. Oh but yeah, I got super addicted to Katamari Damacy rerolls, so uh, that's gonna be an experience of finishing up that game. I just wish it was the one that had the Idol Master song in it, but oh well, because we can't have everything. Uh, I'll have you guys clear out these enemies. Olivia, head in here. Switch to the Killing Edge before I forget. End the turn. And what do we got? Lucina is just gonna go ahead and murder everyone, I, I assume. 
as expected. 69. So many 69s in this episode, and this LP in general. Not like I'm complaining, but whatevs. Yeah, this guy next. Uh, it's an archer, so he can't counterattack, unfortunately. Probably counterattack with eleven sword, but again, it's a sword, so whatevs. I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Uh, we gotta get to that guy. Uh, let's go over here, I guess. Have Robin get rid of this guy. Or can Anna do it? No, she can't. Anna can do that. I don't even know what I was trying to do there, but whatever. Uh, get rid of him, I guess. Oh, he's got a chest key. That's nice to know. I think we could uh, still steal it from the thief if we defeat them before they run out of the battle. And another 69! I got a chest key. I'll get rid of the mend. Waiting just around the mend. Uh, wait in there. Attack this guy, I guess. That was very cool. But yeah, as long as... Because uh, after they get the treasure chest, they'll actually try and leave the battlefield. As long as we defeat them before that, we should be able to steal their stuff. The silver sword does more? Really? Okay, then. But just not as likely to get criticals. So much for that! I don't know anything, apparently. I love her critical face as well. It's just super adorable. Even though she's super scared and stuff. I'm so happy we could finally use Olivia. Like, I just adore the character, but I hated using her because she was a pain in the butt to keep alive. Uh, what do we got? Noe. Head up here. Oh, yeah, I could have paired her up with Sari. Oh, well. Do that next turn. And, gee, I wonder if Robin's gonna survive this. Or a better question, I wonder if Robin's going to murder you in one hit with the help of Frederick. Thankfully they can't. Wow, they didn't go for the chest. Hi. Our comrades. But wait, how? What? The resistance had already infiltrated the castle? <clears throat> Nay, impossible. Something is amiss. Oh god, I forgot this was a character. Oh god, she's creepy. Ooh, it appears I'm just in time for the rebellion Delicious. Please do forgive your friends your warmest welcome. Just remember your promise, or you could be sure I'll remember mine. And they're no longer on our side. Sayri, are you certain the reinforcements are for the resistance? I say, I'm ashamed to say I am. I know some of them by name. But why would they turn the cloak against us now? You'll literally have to change our clothes, like, to red color. Be like, we're the bad guys, so we wear red. Ooh, it seems they touch a nerve. I do so enjoy an appropriate touchy. What the fruit? Now be good, little servant, and scrub the stronghold of these Elysian filth. What? What is this meddling, Exilus? What? Meddling? Why, General Pharaohs? One might also almost mistake you. Oh, ungrateful. This meddling is going to save your post and quite possibly your life. We have no need for your parlor tricks here, schemer. I can handle this myself. Really? Why, yes, of course you can, General. I can see you're doing so well already. You're obviously just waiting to crush the Elysians, toying with them like a cat. I only brought these rebels so they might learn from your shining example. They were so anxious to join the cause. Because you threatened them, tortured them, or perhaps their families, their villages. <laughs> Ooh, I would not wish to burden you with such mundane details, good general. You have more important matters to think after and to deal with quickly. But rest assured, they are quite motivated. Feel free to thank me some other time. Odious freak. He has no- Oh, it's a guy. Whoopsie doopsie. Just the sight of him makes me sick. He is the worm, yet I'm the one left to squirm. Bah! True, his interference may seal our victory, but he'll never hear me say it. I can watch the Let's Play! Yeah, whatever. Why didn't he go for a treasure chest yet? Well, it still doesn't matter because we can't reach him. I guess I'll steal this one. Uh, got 
boots. I guess that's what permanent. Oh, wait, no, it is a thing. It increases movement by two. That's cool. Movement by two. That's really good. What? Okay. Uh, those two should be able to handle it. So we will go over here now. Uh, we'll pair up these two. And I guess we'll get ready for them to kick some butt. Oh, I should have, like, had Lissa heal Sayuri. I need them, though. I need Anna all the way over here to get this treasure. God darn it. I guess for now I'll have you guys step back down. And just guard this place. He takes a Seraph robe. I definitely want that. It's just a matter of whether or not um, I could steal it after he takes it. So we'll find out. I get the road onslaught of enemies, though. But it's no problem for Krom. Krom on and slam. He heals himself now, which is amazing. I love that. Very, very useful, especially for a character that can't die without getting this game over. And we got these guys now. Arc fire, no damage. Alright. Missed that. Go over here, over here, over here, over here. And even more reinforcements, god darn it. Uh, can I steal? Yes, I can. I get the Seraph robe. I'm gonna keep Anna out here just because we need to get her to the other side quicker. Not gonna make the Grave Showman reference. 18 experience points. It's needed for Anna, that's for sure. Uh, I will stay at a distance so we can get out of here quicker. I have your back. And we are good. Okay, that wasn't too terrible. We got two really good stat increase items. I think of who I want to give that to. I don't have any armored units, but... Uh, I think Frederick actually did get a bit slower after he changed his class to Great Knight, so... We might give that to him. Uh, I guess we're going to go over here with Seiri. A bit low on HP, but nothing for her to worry about because, well, they're not attacking this turn. And B, she's just plain awesome. Uh, leave that other one for Anna, or if he goes for Seiri, then I guess it's going to go to them. Uh, 2017. Zero. Six. Okay. Try that out. Uh, thank you for dodging. And Lucina finishes it off. I was kind of hoping Olivia would get the experience, but I guess Sumia still needs to pull her away as well. Get some experience. She's only level 2 after all. Uh, it's risky business, but still. Let's go for it. She's a great dodger now. I gotta keep that in mind. Uh, these two. I mean, they're going to be attacking them regardless. I kind of want to give the experience to Anna, but it's not going to happen, so... It's good for that. And... The Dramatic tension. Let's go for that. <laughs> very, very fun. Thank you. Uh, it feels great when you actually get stuff done correctly and you know what you're doing in this game. It's going to take forever to get Anna over here, though. Uh, oh, I completely forgot that. That's not good for Sumia. Whatever. Uh, if you could dodge it, that'd be great. Or you could just get Vantage. That's always nice. Sayuri died. You don't see that every day. But she's amazing in a bunch of other battles, so I'm not going to hold it against her. Just kind of a freak accident, unfortunately. Dodge that. Sumia gets a bit of damage in. Oh, she's gonna finish him. All right, I'm fine with that. I should be getting her more experience anyway. She does get a very amazing skill um, at level 15, I think, but it's so singing far away. I don't even think we'll get there by the end of the adventure. Okay, I was like, is Olivia gonna like just jab in the sky? 99 damage, my god. 
Like, that's not even the cap I was, like, thinking. It was like, wow, she reached the cap, but no, she's gotten more than 100 before. Uh, more stinking reinforcements, okay. More experience, I guess. I just, I just have to look at it that way. Noe, I want you out of here. Uh, bring these guys out. Oh, my voice is just going. I'm genuinely terrified about my stinking acting final where I have to sing because... Like, it stinks because I I practiced singing it and I can reach the notes no problem. It's just a matter of me constantly coughing and my throat being in so much stinking pain. Uh, not the good kind of pain, like our Togwa friend. Oh, thank you, Olivia. She's awesome. I love our stinking team. Oh my god, they're all so great. Oh yeah, get all that experience level up. Level 5 now. You're just rolling in level ups, Olivia. Uh, we can't open these, so it doesn't really matter. I guess I could give Sumia this uh, this kill, or I could wait. I want to give it to Anna. Let's see what this is going to be about. Okay, let's go for Anna. If she dies, though, we can't get uh, those chests open, so I should be careful. Just, it's, she's not weak, though. It's just a matter of, like keeping her alive though like everyone is I don't think any of my characters are known for good defense I feel like just that dodging is your saving grace a lot of the time and there's crazy thing and powerful to where they finish off enemies before uh, they even get the chance to die from a counter attack or whatever uh, fooey Noe you're gonna go over here Anna can you finish him off I thought so and I can have Lissa heal you as well. That's nice. Ooh, nice, weapon. nice weapon. Where'd you get it? We're gonna uh, have Lissa heal. Very, very good. Oh, so stinking close. Go over here. Uh, are you just the only ones left? Okay, fine. End the turn. Anna just, this is just the Anna episode, I guess. Get all that experience, my friend. Sold out. I love all of her single critical attacks. Come again. She sounds so pleasant. Uh, avoid this guy. Boo. A boo. Oh, hello. Sort of hoping it would be pick a god and pray, but oh well. More reinforcements? Jeez, how many more are there going to be? Let's get in over there. Uh, sure. He'll know it. Why not? Get some free experience. Yeah. yeah. Do I ever need to upgrade the stinking, uh, healing weapons? Cause, like, everyone's always a D-class mage or whatever, but, like, I'm okay with that. I never feel like... I don't know. I probably just don't look into it as much, but, like, are there some really solid healing, uh, staffs that I don't know about? I might have to look into that. I've never known for playing defensively. Though it is very helpful, so I'm happy to have my healers with me. Even though she just got one sting and stat increase right there. Uh, and the turn. They're running up. Another one. Uh, he's close. Uh, okay, we'll go with them. Gonna do that and that. Very, very nice. You get a discount. Uh, she's at level 8 right now. We might get her to level 10 in this area. Like, if these two get her to 9, if she can fight the boss, then I'm all for it. Get them away just so they don't attack them. I'd rather have Anna be the one that they take on. Let's take her on like Pokemon. Uh, we should be good. Let's see what we got. Just don't die, Anna, and then we'll be good to go. Thank you for no damage. Thanks. Hammer broke. Oh no! Chairs can't do hammer time anymore. I'll have to get her a new one. Uh, does she have a backup weapon or no? Okay, good. She has a steel axe. Wow, I'm actually prepared for once. Who would have thought? that, dodge that, dodge this. 
get that experience. Unfortunately, I didn't get to level 9 like I was hoping, but whatever. Uh, everyone's gone, so I just need to get Anna over here so she could steal some stuff. Very chill when you get to, like, the end, like, the, no one else is going to do anything. The boss isn't going to move. Open up the chest. We got Leon L. Very nice. 10,000 gold. And we got ourselves a Master Seal. Not worth it in the end, unfortunately, but whatever. Uh, I want to see if Anna could take down this boss. So let's bring her over here. Bring Olivia as well, because I wouldn't mind her getting experience as well. As well, as well, as well. Not, not sure how many times I'm going to say that, but whatever. Uh, bring her right here. Alyssa, heal her in case she ends up running to the front. And the turn. She doesn't move, thank you. 30. Yeah, we need to weaken them a bit. I wonder if Sayri would have something to say, but I feel like she's going to kill him in one hit, so... Uh, where even is Sayri? Oh, you know, she died. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, let's see. Maybe. Possibly. Oh, wow, that's a lot of damage. Let's go for it. In the name of the Conqueror, you shall not take this fortress! See what we got, Sumia. Good job, bud. Well done. I may not live to see Walmart unify all mankind with my own eyes, but I have seen it in my dreams, and that is enough. About time I made some progress. That's not how it goes, Sumia. Fortify! Resources the HP of all allies in range. Okay, I guess I got my answer on. Do the staffs get really stinking good? Robin and Frederick are the MVPs. No. Stereo has fallen. But I'm afraid our new enemy has the fortress surrounded. <clears throat> new enemy? You mean the rest of the former resistance? Ah, <clears throat> uh, sir. Uh, words cannot express my shame, my regret. Uh, finally, I succeed in uniting them, but only against us. Sire. That's not you say. You're supposed to say, my lord. Dire news. Our forces to the north and south have been de de have been decimated by Walmart and Yenfei. What's worse, most of the survivors have turned their coats for the Empire. B but our but but our troops numbered in the hundreds of thousands. Oh, great. The Empire must have had more. Please. Or perhaps been better trained and equipped. <laughs> Blast, Walmart and my brother. Where are their armies now? Yes, sir. Marching toward this fortress, my lady. It's only a matter of time. <clears throat> so much for fortune favoring the bold. This war was lost before it even began. <sighs> All our struggles until now, and we've yet to do so much as dent the Empire. Krom? Hmm? What is it, Robin? Do you have something to say? We need to leave here, right away. Have you lost your wits? We're surrounded! All right. When the other armies arrive, then we'll be trapped for a certainty. If we intend to escape, now is our best chance. Right. The dynasts outside betray only us out of fear for our empire. They'll only put up token resistance without the ma masters watching. Right. But we can't keep running forever. How do we hope to turn the tide? Or tip the scales? Yeah. By striking at either Walmart or Yenfei before they join strength. <laughs> either one seems a death sentence. Nay. Our general would be upon us before we could finish with the other. Well... I agree. 
which is why we attack Bo. Our army lies in tatters, yet you would divide it by half? No. I didn't say by half. Krom would lead our strongest troops against Yenfei. Meanwhile, a smaller force would attack Walmart. Hold on. A smaller force? We couldn't defeat him with double our entire number. No. I didn't say we defeat him. We only need to distract him. Hmm. Spend more lives to buy the other team time. Really? This smaller force would face our most dangerous mission yet. It would need a leader of unparalleled skill, reckless bravery. All right. Grom, please, you're embarrassing me. I'll do it already. Just stop with all the compliments. <laughs> this is no time for japes, Basilo. The stakes could not be higher. All right. I am being serious. I'll lead the squad, though I prefer my stakes well done. You get it? Because his stakes are high? That's just his way, Robin. Bad jokes come with the bravado. But the oaf clearly has faith in your thinking. And I as well. All of us do, I'd wager. Somehow you always find a way to best the odds. Right. Then it's settled. I'll make preparations and be off. The rest of you stay with Krom and keep him safe. <laughs> Godspeed, Basilo. Stop! <clears throat> Lucina, what are you? I'll keep you safe. I cannot allow you to go, Con Basilo. You will die in this battle. I know it for truth. What? Oh, great. You know, lass, you have a strange way of saying goodbye. All right, then. Who is it? Who kills me? Is it Walmart himself? Please say yes. It'd make a poor song to die at the end of some farmer's pitchfork. Yes. It was Walmart. Or so goes the story I heard. We must change our plans so fate cannot take this course. All I needed to know. Thank you much, lass. I'll be careful. <laughs> You're still going? But I just told you! Nah. Aye, I heard you just fine. But someone still has to stall his division from advancing. If he's the one that kills me, well then, I'll just avoid confronting him. You don't grow this old and handsome without knowing how to avoid trouble. But don't you see? It's never that simple. Listen. Don't worry, love. He'll be fine. He'll have me to keep an eye on him. Hell no! You are coming, woman! You're the reigning con! I thought you intended to survive this oaf. Regna Ferox has two cons, and now you're responsible for both. I dare you to die now! <laughs> alright, alright, you could come. Hope that's alright, Krom. Yes. Just look after each other. Leave it to me. I'll bring this big ox back on a leash if it comes to that. Luck and more be with you all. We'll meet again soon. But please, your future, you must... Hold on. Please yourself, not another word. Don't you put any stock in this destiny hogwash. I fully intend to outlive all you sprogs. Just see if I don't. And as for your future, it could kiss my big brown Feroxy booty cheeks. <laughs> well, that's one way to end a chapter. Oh my god, Balsilo and Flavia are really singing awesome characters. I just wish we could actually play as them. But whatever, they got a mission to handle, and we have faith in them. Next time on Fire Emblem Awakening, we're going to take our smaller group and make an escape from this castle. This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night.